Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody. Let's see what has happened yesterday on the euro currency. So as we, as we have suggested in our weekly research, uh, now we see that market is showing the bounce, uh, bounce from the uh, resistance area. That is the 618 major resistance from the whole move to the downside. And we said that that, that will be normal if market will show some response, some respect of this area by the minor retracement. At the same time, we also have noted that if market really has intention to continue move higher, it should not show too deep retracement because now in fact it stands between the targets between the one six, uh, 618 extension target and 100% extension target and too deep retracement will not, will not be just normal for uh, upward continuation and currently you can see that market has reached our uh, if you could say um, crucial area so that in fact market stands in the edge and depending on what will happen if market will hold there and turn to the upside then we will see probably move to the 136.85 but if market will fail there and move below the weekly pivot support one monthly pivot point we could say that probably guys retracement is over and market has reestablished move to the downside because that will be in, in this case not an ordinary move that will be a bit uh, curious action for uh, upper trending market so this will be not normal that's why in the current week we will have to monitor the price action around this area so if still market will hold there then uh, we could get reversal pattern guys so that could be some kind of the three drive sell pattern on the daily time frame chart because take a look that this top stands at 127 of that swing down the 1618 of that swing down stands precisely at the target of this A, B, C bottom, D point. Also, if we suggest that market will hold here, the 1618 of that minor swing will also stand right here. So, uh, simultaneously, if even we will not treat it as the three drive, that will be some kind of the edge pattern, uh, wedge pattern. And uh, that is also the reversal pattern based on the classical approach to the technical analysis. <coughs> that uh, very suitable and uh, this possible reversal pattern here coincides with the current weekly research because this action in fact just the respect of this on this support that is weekly confidence support market has formed here the bullish engulfing pattern on the weekly time frame chart uh, and appearing of the reversal is housed in pattern on the daily time frame just confirmed will confirm our thought that that just the respect just the bounce respect on this area and in general market stands bearish and, uh, on the higher time frame chart and uh, after that we probably could try to search the possibility to enter short as we suggested at the end of this retracement that's why current situation is very interesting but meantime in the short term perspective we will have to watch for uh, price action around this area because if you take a look at the forward time frame chart you'll see that market has hit our first destination point that is first confluence 135.36, 135.40 area that also coincides with the normal uh, classical support resistance you can see this previously was resistance now it will become the support here again well and we said that that will be just perfect if market will hold here and reestablish move to the upside but still that will not be the strategy if market will pass slightly lower if market will reach this uh, double pivot point area and next confidence support we need that market uh, swamp in this area stuck in this area if it will happen and market turns to the upside then our daily analysis still will, still will be valid and we could expect the action to the 136.85 but if market will fail here and move below it well in this case that will be too much downward action to after that just re reaching just fib, fib resistance area so that will put under question the possible retracement and uh, continuation uh, to the upside and uh, in fact that will be the first 
bell of the possible downward continuation. Passing through this really significant support area will tell us that market is really weak and probably we should forget about upward continuation. At the same time, guys, if you still would like to take the long position, you should keep an eye on this area. Because I suspect that if even market will pass through this area and break it to the downside, that will hardly happen at the first touch. So if you will, for instance, will take the long position right here, you could ex expect, you could count on some bounce up at the first touch of this area because there is this really significant support area. And that bounce, possible bounce, will give you chance to move your stop to the break even. So if you even will become wrong, uh, you will be able to exit from this uh, position with no loss. Because market, in the most cases, probability suggests that uh, market, pro market will bounce out from this area at the first touch. That's why it's preferable to use very significant support resistance area for entry. Well, uh, that's in fact all that we could say about the euro currency. Just keep an eye on the current development. Uh, if market will form here some clear reversal pattern, then probably we could try to take the uh, long position currently. Guys, on the 30 minute chart, on the hourly time frame chart, I do not see any uh, reasonable patrons uh, here. Well, could we treat it as the double bottom? Hardly, I suppose. Only maybe on the 5 minute chart or, the on, or on the 15 minute chart. On the hourly time frame chart, I do not see currently no reversal patrons. No butterflies. Maybe this will be the wedge. Maybe market will form. Uh, head and shoulders here or something of that sort. But currently I, do, I see nothing. I see nothing yet. Uh, let's see what will happen. But if market will form here something, something or some reversal pattern, maybe by hitting also this uh, support cluster. Um, in this case we could try probably take the position uh, on the long side of the market because uh, here we will be able to place very tight stop, slightly lower than this confidence support. But the target will be 136.85. So that will be excellent risk reward ratio for the uh, current position. And also we will be protected by this really support, uh, significant support area that uh, could give us excellent assistance if when the market will bounce up on the first, ta the first touch of this area we will be able to move our stop to break even. So that's major idea of the current situation in your currency.